Hey everyone, what's up? I hope you're having an amazing day so far. Today's video is not about low dose tea. It's not about me being trans. It's just gonna be centered around living life for you. And I know that I may sound like a broken record because I talk about this a lot, but this morning I just felt like I really needed to be reminded that it's so important to check in with myself and to figure out, okay, what can I do today to show myself compassion and love? Because it's a crazy time. It's a crazy, crazy time. There's so much going on. And there are some days where I feel super excited, super motivated and happy and ready to take on the day. But then there are other days like today where I wake up and I'm not necessarily sad, but I'm a little bit unmotivated and I'm feeling a little bit overwhelmed and I just don't really know where to start. But with that being said, I also feel really blessed and very grateful for what I have and I know that I'm surrounded by so much love and so much care. But still, sometimes I'm needing some sort of reminder or some sort of sign to remind me and to show me how important it is to make my life choices based on what brings me joy and what makes me feel happy and not what others expect of me or what society expects of me. And today I just didn't really get that reminder. I didn't get that sign. And so I'm making this video to check in with all of you, but also just to check in with myself and kind of utilize this as something to help catapult me into this day and remember that it's really important to take one day at a time and to be there for myself and to be my biggest advocate. And so I hope if you're watching this right now, no matter what time of day it is, that this is your sign to love yourself and to show yourself compassion. And I know that it can be crazy to navigate your gender and your sexuality and your identity in this world, but just remembering that no one is ever going to live your life the way that you see it, the way that you feel it, the way you experience it. No one has ever experienced the exact same trauma or the exact same experiences. And because of that, it's so important to be your biggest advocate and to be your best friend in a way and to just love yourself and show yourself compassion because no one else knows exactly what it's like to be you. And that may be obvious to some people and I envy you if that is obvious to you, but I think for a lot of us, we forget that we're worthy. We forget that we're deserving of compassion and love. And sometimes we seek that in others instead of trying to seek it within ourselves first because we just really don't think that we're enough or we really don't think that we're deserving of our... My phone just died right in the middle of that really great speech. But anyways, what I was saying was that I think sometimes I feel like I'm not even deserving of my own self-love. And I think that a lot of you could probably relate to that. So I just really wanted to make this video as a reminder to all of you that it's really, really, really so important to get in the habit of checking in with yourself, but also just making choices for you and not for other people. Obviously, this is way, way, way easier said than done. And I know that it takes time to learn how to show yourself compassion and to learn how to love yourself, especially in a world that tries to convince you that your existence is not enough or that your existence is not worthy of love. But that's one of the reasons why I'm here and why I make YouTube videos. I know that I'm not a huge YouTuber and I don't have a lot of subscribers, but with the following and the community that I have built, I really wanna utilize that and share from my heart what helps me remind me to live my life for myself and not for anybody else, not for my parents, not for my friends, not for my partner, not for this world, but just literally for myself because I'm the only one who knows how difficult it's been and how hard I fought. But that's why I wanna share it out on a platform because even if only one person sees this video or hears what I'm saying or it only affects one person, that's enough for me to want to continue making videos about my journey on low dose tea being queer and really coming into this realization of how important it is to love yourself. So I appreciate all of you who have made it this far in this video. I know that this is not my usual content necessarily, but this is the real me. This is me, this is the day that I'm having, and I appreciate all of you listening to my little spiel, but I just always wanna do what I can to share out the love that I have for all of you and to let you know that I'm proud of you. You know, in case no one's told you today, I'm really proud of you and I love you and you're valid. Your existence is more than enough. And 
this journey of navigating not just your gender, not just your sexuality, not just your identity, but just your life. It's tough. It's really, really tough. And life and this world and the society will constantly throw things at you and make you feel like you need to conform or be a certain way or change. But I am just here to say that this is your life. So do what you want to do with your life and make choices for you and not for anybody else. You're all so valid and I'm so appreciative that you're here and I'm so happy that you're here and it makes me so proud that you're here. So just remember that. I know that, you know, we can't have good days every single day, but I hope that this can be a reminder to really love yourself and figure out how you can show yourself some compassion today. And as always, if you wanna say hi to me, or if you have any comments, questions, concerns, happy thoughts that you wanna share with me, all of my social media is down below. I respond to all of you at some point. Sometimes it takes me a second, but I always get back to you. I appreciate each and every one of you. Thank you so much for listening to me. I know that sometimes I repeat myself. It might seem like I'm just going in circles all the time, but thank you for sticking with me and watching this video. I'm gonna go take some deep breaths, walk the dogs, and do my best to have a good day. And I hope that you will too. I will see you in my next video. Let me know if you have any video ideas because I kind of feel like I am running out of video ideas and content and I just feel overwhelmed at all of it. So let me know if you have any suggestions or anything that you would like to know about my journey being me, not just being on low dose tea, whatever it is, let me know. And I'll see you in my next video. Peace.